Hey everyone and Happy New Year! Melissa here, back with another video, and today we're reacting to Momoland's Thumbs Up. Um, as you guys can see, I'm a little dressed up today because I have church. So, um, let's just get into this so I can get ready. That's a different sound. I love her black hair. That looks like the shipping company that a lot of like people who get K-pop albums use. Cowgirl boots with a flapper dress. <laughs> This is like twice as likely, but with like, I don't know, like the vibe of the music video is really different. Oh, it's gonna be this dance now. Something's missing. I don't know what's missing from the song, but there's like something that's not 100% right with it. I like the chorus's background music, but I Ooh, her makeup. Hologram dance. We are supposed to have holograms in 2020, but we are. I don't know. Oh, cool. That looks very animated though. <laughs> All right, so that was Momo Land Thumbs Up. I'm not sure how to feel about it. Like, I'm not sure. It's not bad. It's just really, really weird. Like, I'm listening to it and I'm like, it's good, but there's also something missing. There's something that needs to be added to the song to make it like a great comeback. Right now, it feels like a very average, like, upbeat song, but it's not something that I'm automatically going to be drawn to. Like, it's not something that when I'm thinking about K-pop, that's going to, like, pull me in and make me think about, oh, I kind of want to do that song today. It's okay. Like, nothing super special. I see that it came out December 30th. I was spending it with my family, so I did not um, record this until today. Um, but the colors really remind me of the shipping company so i'm assuming that's one of their sponsors so it's like a it's like a subtle plug for sh like that shipping company but in a way that's not putting their name on all the products it's kind of just putting momo land on it but everyone knows the colors of that company i'm going to hmm. i do like the momo land logo that's really cute um 
I see that they're getting a lot of dislikes still. I'm wondering if this is from the epidemic that was their career about a year ago, a year and a half ago at this point, where um, they released BAM and Boom Boom and they sounded really similar. If that's why people are still doing dislikes or if these are just genuine, like I don't like the song dislikes. But in my opinion, if I were to rank it out of like one out of 10, I would give it like a 6.5 or a 7 because it's average, nothing super special. There's something about Moment Land that makes you like their point moves obviously i was already doing it this reminds me of like the loser but i know it's like thumbs up and it's a loser for me anyway so that's like just a quickie little reaction to their comeback i might listen to it a little bit more throughout the year maybe i'll start to like it more but as of right now it's probably not gonna be in my top songs of 2020 um but yeah if you guys like this video don't forget to like comment share subscribe and i will see you all in the next one